And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon. And we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It is CSKA Moscow facing Real Madrid. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. Well, it was an incredible campaign, wasn't it? It's hard enough to win the Champions League, but to go on and repeat that success is really, really difficult. But they are a massive club, big expectations, top players. They need a bit of luck along the way. They certainly had some of that last season, but you expect them to go deep into this competition. Can they go all the way, though? So the initial 11 for the home side. Wing backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing back, Lee? Not at all under Bruce Rock. It's a very, very demanding role, as we can see. The full backs are exposed both offensively and defensively. Lots of support inside them, but going forward, they need to try and get the ball into the box for the two up front. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois, the Belgian, will be in goal. Marcelo starts with Carvajal as fullbacks. Luka Modric plays with Toni Kroos in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Karim Benzema. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Here is Marco Asensio. Thunders clear. Tony Kroos. In possession, Marcelo. Beautifully timed. Benzema. Look at Modric. Well, they are the record winners of this great competition, Real Madrid. And you always feel, Lee, that no matter the stage of the competition, and slipped through by Karim Benzema. That will give them quite the lift. An early opening goal lead. Well, you always want to start quickly, and there's a certainly a quick start there. What a finish. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. So underway again with Real Madrid in front. Alan Zagoev. Mario Fernandez on the ball. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. And on the ball, Vlasic. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Now just couldn't keep himself onside. Very good use of advantage there by the official, letting the play carry on and then only subsequently handing out the yellow card. Yeah, absolutely, and that's what the fans want. They want to see the game going on. They don't want to see it stopped or something like that. You can always go back and book the player later. In possession, Marcelo. Benzema. Benzema seducing with his passing. Well, he was just a fraction offside then. That's all he needs to be, a fraction. And it was so close. And here... 
here's Zagoev. Will there be a tangible end product? And a strong tackle. Modric. Is it going to be the moment for Gareth Bale? Still a chance. And Bale slips it through. Benzema! And he's fired it against the post. Wow, so, so close to extending the lead. They keep on pushing like this. Surely the pressure will tell. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Crucial block from Varane. Modric. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. And he's made headway. Does he have the beating of the goalkeeper? Pulls it back. And the goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. Well, let's have another view of that goal. It's going their way, 2-0. Adan Zagoev. Well, can he make this move count? And whipped into the box. And they deal with the threat this time. Room to roam for the Merengues here. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? And crossed in there by Gareth Bale. And on the ball, Vlasic. Mario Fernandez on the ball. Marcelo read it perfectly and intercepted. An abundance of space. Running towards goal. One man to beat. Well, that is a moment he would like to airbrush from history. Well, he's had an absolute nightmare there. The goal's in front of him. Just hit it. This is Gareth Bale. Marco Asensio defeat it through. Splendid save from the keeper, danger averted. Yeah, he didn't have long to react to that, but you have to praise his reflexes there. And over comes the corner. And the header so near. Well, he's in a great position. Technique's pretty good but he just hits the woodwork. The ball with Magnusson. Is he going to punish them here? Well, they really had to be on their toes defensively, given the circumstances. And progress made with the ball at his feet by Bale. I think everyone knew that was foul play, and the referee left with little choice but to award the free kick. The referee has gone back now to hand out the yellow card. Opted for the laissez-faire approach. Most would say good refereeingly. No, it's absolutely spot on. Keep the game going as long as you can, but then you can always go back and book him after the ball's gone out of play. Good refereeing. And Benzema at the hub of this attack. Let's see what he does next. And on the ball, Vlasic. 
the ball with Magnusson given away Benzema there's a slide draw pass well somehow the goalkeeper got to it corner given to Real Madrid Played into the centre of the box. Well, he couldn't quite keep the header down. Well, it was the pace on the cross. Sometimes with that much power on the cross, just cushion it, otherwise it goes over. Georgi Shenikov. Now, what can he do here? The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. And on the ball, Vlasic. Well, that's very smart defending and now they have the ball again. Marco Asensio. Karim Benzema. And slipped through by Karim Benzema. Just couldn't capitalise there. And the ball is in the net. The crowd have gone crazy, and quite rightly so. What a finish that is. Well, let's see that strike again. First time is always very, very difficult to strike a ball. The timing has to be right, the technique has to be right. But above all, you have to concentrate on the ball as it's coming to you. You know you're not going to take a touch. Concentration is everything. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. And with that, the first half draws to a close. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, if he plays like that in the second half, we're in for a real treat. He's scored, he's direct, creative, and he unnerves defenders. And so the second half commences here. Well, it was one-way traffic in the first half. They're going to need all their time if they have designs on a comeback. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, let's see, does he mean business? And just failed to keep the ball in play that time. Here's Ramos. Here is Marco Asensio. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Well, can he make this move count? And Vlasic. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Well, he's setting the table for his team. He's taken on the shorts, but he's failed to beat the goalkeeper from there, Lee. Well, it was well worth the effort, but uh, well off target. Marcelo lost it just then. Carrying a genuine threat here. And so it will be a corner. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Over it comes. And heading it just over the bar. Yeah, he thinks he's in, he thinks he's scored. And it's just over the bar. 